Western Mass News viewer reached out to our newsroom wondering when a historic clock tower in downtown Springfield would be restored. And Western Mass News reporter Paris Dunford getting answers tonight from city officials. We want to know what's going on with it. Standing tall in downtown Springfield, the Campanile Clock Tower is a staple to the city. But according to Peter Garvey, Director of Capital Asset Construction, it's been broken for about 35 years. We asked people who walked through downtown if they knew the clocks on the tower weren't working. Most people said they hadn't noticed. But some residents, like David Murray, remember when the tower bells rang through the city. Usually when the clock did work, it had beautiful sounding bells with it, too. So. I enjoyed it, and I believe everybody in the city would enjoy it, too. The Campanile Tower was built in 1910 with intricate details and materials from all over the country, constructed to become a historic part of the city. It's not a digital clock. It's got a lot of moving parts to it and a lot of mechanics to it. It's got a limestone exterior from Indiana, and it's got terracotta on the top. Uh, and the bells are from Pennsylvania. The city recently launched an initiative to fix the iconic clock tower. Fixing the clock comes with a hefty price tag. The project is expected to cost more than $30 million. Funding has always been an issue. I know there's a will to fix the clock, but uh, the funding is it's $30 million, so it's a big project for the city of Springfield. City officials are currently working with Congressman Neal's office to get this project on the upcoming infrastructure bill expected to go through the White House. They are also working to qualify the clock for a Community Preservation Act grant. Now, Garvey tells Western Mass News there's no telling how long until they'll have that $30 million. And even once they secure the funding, Springfield residents won't be able to enjoy the clock anytime soon. This project would probably take about two, two and a half years to design and probably two, two and a half years to to uh, reconstruct and construct. So it's a total of about five year project from when we get funding. But residents say they're just looking forward to hearing those bells once again and being able to look up the tower to catch the time. Well, hopefully I'm around. That'll make me about 68. Well, hopefully so, you're here to see it. Yes, yes, I would be. Reporting in Springfield, Paris Sunford for Western Mass News.